Hi, this is Dr. Joni Liu. Today I got a message from a friend about coronavirus and that it is spreading. Okay, now I don't agree about spreading bad news, but so I'm going to spread some good news for you. Okay, first I'm going to explain the mechanism of a virus. Okay, a virus is a single cell entity and it likes living in certain conditions, just like we do as um, multicellular, very complex organs. We also have, uh, you know, conscious desires to live the way we want to. Now, for a lot of viruses, they are actually dormant until they find an environment which is hospitable to them. Now, for them, what's hospitable is wet, damp, uh, wet, dark, and very sticky, very phlegmy, okay? So it really likes that kind of um, sticky environment. You know, for us, it might mean that there's lubrication, okay? So we do need a bit of that lubrication inside our body so that our organs can move over each other without causing friction and therefore harm and pain, okay? So viruses love a very rich, yucky environment that we wouldn't like. So when they find an environment inside the body which is totally suitable to their uh, well-being, then they will definitely flourish. And so that is what wakes up a virus. And so what I got is some information uh, about how you can prevent it and, um, and definitely treat it at the same time. If you're suffering from any kind of flu, because every cold and flu is viral. Okay, so off the top of my head, stop eating anything that's white. So no white sugar, no white salt, no white flour, um, you know, no dairy products, no cheese, no milk. Um, that's pretty much the gamut because dairy products and all these other things just cause more liquid to be uh, expressed in the body. So it just makes that environment inside your body more hospitable and welcoming to that virus and makes it want to grow inside you, okay? So avoid those things. And instead, eat a lot of fresh foods, you know, um, whole organic, if you can do that, uh, vegetables, uh, keep it quiet with, you know, not so much fruit because that's still sugary, but, you know, green leafy vegetables, really good and have a small amount of protein, okay? So um, hopefully uh, that will help you. So it's really simple, okay? But the other thing is, and I want to quote the guy who wrote As a Man Thinketh, and that's James Allen. So he says that the soul attracts that which it secretly harbors, that which it loves, and also that which it fears. So very, very, be very, very careful about where your mindset is. If you're going to be looking for bad news, you're going to find that it's going to infiltrate your mind. He also said that anxiety quickly demoralizes the whole body and lays it open to the entrance of disease. And that is truly the cause of every disease that you're going to encounter because it starts in the mind. So don't look for no more news. And if it happens to come across your desk, you know, your computer, wherever you're looking, pass it on by and don't get emotionally involved with it, okay? Now, I am emotionally involved with it because I happen to care about people's health and I care about my own health. And these are the things that I've been doing, the, the stuff that I told you not to do and the, to the things I've been telling you to do, really simple, are really simple okay and definitely preventive so think about what you're doing <laughs> think about what you're thinking about because you are stronger than you think and you do absolutely have control over your body and your mind okay so if you have any questions just pm me here on this platform i'll be very happy to answer any questions bye